Palestine's Hamas is to announce its new political program later on Monday. Drafts of the document show a less aggressive language, dropping references to holy war against Jews. Hamas's more moderate image could help it get taken off Western terrorism lists. The new document also plays down ties to the Muslim Brotherhood, which Egypt considers a terror organization. And Daoud Qutab is a journalist and author specializing in Middle Eastern political and social issues. He says this move will allow Hamas to be more involved in the peace process. Well, I think some circles will take it seriously, probably more so in Europe than in the U.S. But it's a step in the right direction because I think it's an attempt by the outgoing Hamas leader, Khaled Mash'al, to uh, leave a kind of a more moderate uh, uh, platform to, to the new coming leadership than what he uh, inherited or he created. And I think this is good for Hamas being much more involved in the political scene than before. The key issue, I think, is uh, whether and how they will join the PLO. There's a lot of discussions in the reconciliation about Hamas being part of the PLO. And once they are part of the PLO, then whatever the PLO has signed, such as the Oslo Agreement and such as the mutual recognition between Israel and the PLO, would apply to Hamas because they would be part of the PLO. This is the big crucial uh, decision. And you said initially whether uh, they have to prove uh, that they are actually moderating. This would be the way to prove it. If they join the PLO without the PLO changing its position, I think this would be one of the best uh, ways to prove that they are indeed moving towards a more moderate point of view.